perfect. All right, here we go. Hey guys, it's May May and my trusty sidekick. Oh, Vinny is here. Happy 4th of July. Vinny. That's today. <laughs> Happy 4th. Yes, we're working on the 4th, but I want to clarify. I know people are like, I cannot believe you're making your staff work on the 4th. We are not making our staff work on the 4th. They chose to work They today. chose it. Somebody said to me, so what day are we taking on for the 4th? And I said, I tell you what, actually Amanda said it. I said, Amanda, poll the staff, whatever they want to do, that's what we'll do. And they decided since... Thursday was the day before Friday. They'd rather take Friday off to have a three-day weekend. Plus, uh, most of the guys, most of them are not going to fireworks shows till tonight. And we saw our fireworks show last night. So, we're not forcing them to work on the 4th. They wanted to. So, it makes sense. Because I'd rather have a three-day weekend, too. Right? But you're not going to take one. Let's but just be honest. If I were, if if I, I would rather have a three-day weekend. I, I get it. Yeah. Um. Okay. So... First, I have to tell you how much I love this calendar. Like, I really do. If you have not seen this um, calendar tutorial, I did this early in the year. Um, you can find this. It's called the um, Desk Calendar Turned Mini Album. And I have a full um, video and playlist of this. And we do this every month. We do the previous month. So, this is normally, in its day job, I'll show you, it is a calendar. So, this is my month of July that was already pre-made. I made it back in the day. But then... After the month has passed, I come back in and I do an image that reminds me of that month, like the one big spotlight or the highlight of the month. And when I'm done, I'll have a whole mini album from it. So if you haven't seen it before, I'll do a quick little flip through because I know I get a lot of questions after the video's over. So I want to just do a flip through. So there's January. That was when they won a tournament. This is our May May Cruise in February. This is the return of Mr. Big Ears. This is Addie turning one. How cute is that? That my favorite picture in the world. This is like, thank you, Jesus, for cake. That's what that one is. And then our two graduates from um, May, and that is Jared and Thomas right there for you guys graduating. And this month, you're not going to believe this. I think I can use this paper that I have in here because I have been covering it up. But I think I can use it. You think? Okay. Funny story from this month. You think it's a funny story? Well, yeah, it's pretty funny. It's very funny. Okay, so my... It's a little embarrassing, <laughs> but it's still funny. My stepfather... Not for me embarrassing, but, you know. My stepfather is probably, arguably, the biggest Alabama fan in our family. He's a big Alabama fan. I'm not going to call him the biggest. You think he's bigger than you? No. I think he might be. No. Maybe. I don't know. But he's a huge Alabama fan. And he had the opportunity last month... To no, was it the month before? Might have been the month before. Might it was been, May because it was at the Regions Golf. So tournament. it was May. He had the opportunity to attend the Regions Golf Tournament and get a little backstageness, not a lot. But because Nick Saban had had his hip surgery, he wasn't actually playing in the tournament. He was doing the putt around or the um, what do they call that? Is it the putt around? Something like that. Well, at this particular, he, he was just riding around, going from hole to hole, and just talking with folks people. and stuff. And so my dad was able to get a picture with Nick Saban. Now, it's a full-size picture, like it's them standing there or whatever. I've cropped this down for my book. But here's what's funny about it, and the reason I chose it as my highlight for the yeah, calendar. And the thing, the funny part is, and you took this out, he's got his gut all sucked in, <laughs> chest poked out. He's like... <laughs> I mean, he's a proud man the standing other thing there with is, Coach Saban. You see his face. Y'all see Dad's face. I don't believe he was this happy when they handed him his first son. I don't think he was. He's pretty ecstatic at that moment, this I believe. is the happiest I have seen him ever. That face. And he is. He's got his chest up and he's all puffed up because he's standing, standing next to Nick. If you don't know, Nick Saban is Alabama football coach. and There's not a person watching that doesn't know who he is. You know what? Surely. If I wouldn't know if it was somebody else's college football coach. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't know. I mean, it's like. More important than the president. Somewhere I mean, on this come desk. On. There it is. I have lost my trimmer. All right. I got it. So I got to tell you what we did because I thought this was hilarious. So dad, the day this happened, you know, there's certain people in your life that don't text you unless it's important. Right. Dad's one of those. Okay. Now some of you guys are going to be confused. I want to clear it up. This is my stepfather, but I also call him dad. He treats me just like his daughter and I love him like a dad. So anyway, um, he sent out a group text. <laughs> 
Yes. To everyone with this photo in it. It was hilarious to me. When we got it, we all started commenting on how happy he looked and how, how excited he was. So, as soon as I got it, I messaged my mom and I said, no one better take this from me. I'm having this put on everything that sits still. We are putting dad's picture on it. So, when I said that, they all went with me and went, wait a minute. We'll all, for Father's Day, everything he gets, everything he opens has to have this picture on it. So, I ordered him for Father's Day. I ordered him a set of post-it notes, a pillow, <laughs> a pillow that's him and Nick. He got, um, what else did I get him? He got a keychain, which he uses, by the way. He pulled it out of his pocket the other day and showed it to my brother. And there was something else I got him. Oh, a calendar. This is my favorite. I got him a calendar, and the, every month it's the same picture. <laughs> it doesn't change. Well, he, Tracy said he coached at Ole Miss. Well, he actually coached at Michigan State. I don't and know. And then he went to LSU. Then he went to the Miami Dolphins. Listen, this is Vinny's main. And okay. now he is at. The University of Alabama. I don't know anything about that, but listen. So, my brother, so at Father's Day, we had Father's Day luncheon at my house. Before they got there, my mother had this picture put on an 11 by 14 framed piece, and dad was so happy. He even took his Father's Day present to church Sunday morning to show everybody. Oh, yeah. He had no idea we were giving him all the other stuff. So, when he opened his present, um, I don't think I've mentioned this to you guys, but my dad did something to his um, back. Like he has a compressed disc. Is his compressed? Yeah. And it was touching the nerve, so it's been bothering his arm. So he's been having to drive the car with a pillow to rest it on to kind of get it in the right position. So I got him that pillow. When we got to Father's Day, my brother and sister-in-law got him a stuffed animal that was wearing a t-shirt with this picture on it, which was hilarious. Yes. They also got him luggage tags with this picture on it. And um, what else did he get? I think that's all he got with this picture on it. But we had so much fun. Look, Shutterfly... We were using Shutterfly like crazy. Now, Mama didn't. Mama went to one of the one-hour photos, like uh, yeah. Walgreens, and got it put on done. Canvas. And they did a good job. And she had the picture. It's This is the texted picture he sent us, and they were able to do it. So I thought this had to be the highlight from June because my whole family has laughed about this picture. And we went to lunch one day when I gave him his Post-it notes, and he peeled one off and stuck it on the wall like they were going to be his calling card wherever he went. He was just going right. to leave it. Stuck it on the wall at the restaurant. At the restaurant. So we have to. Uh, make this the highlight. Don't y'all agree? I think it has to be. Okay. Where'd that um, football paper go I brought in here? What'd I do with it? Did I hide it from myself? Well, what did I do with that thing? I brought that six by six football paper in. Oh, it fell on the floor. I was say, I in the search, it. here it is. Okay, so I'm going to use paper from this football pad, and just so y'all know, we didn't mention it yet, but the Fourth of July sale is going on today. It's the twenty five percent off. This is on our store, memememadeit.com. We have 25% off from now till midnight tomorrow night. And this product and the basketball one are in the 35% off clearance. So y'all need the to, baseball one. And the baseball one. There's a lot of new stuff in the clearance. Yep. But it's, it's called the bargain, bargain buys tab. So check that out. There's some new stuff in there. Oh, and before I forget, clubs, you don't know this. You might want to look away. You I didn't, did it, didn't you? I didn't tell you. Well, you told me you were considering it, but you did it, didn't you? Several people said... Can you give us a deal on Stamp Club? So here's what we did. Today and tomorrow only, till this sale is over, midnight tomorrow night, your first month of Stamp Club is 25% off. So you can sign up where you prepay for next month. That that initial $11.99 is 25% off. After that, it's regular price every month, $11.99 a month. So we, we were able to do that. So you don't have to have a coupon code or anything for that. When you sign up, the system knows it. Michelle said... Uh... I had no idea who Nick Saban is, but I know who Mark Stoops is. I don't know who that is either. I'm sorry. Who's Mark Stoops? Well, he coaches at Kentucky. And uh, and then Football somebody said, Kentucky? yeah, somebody said, which one is your dad? <laughs> so anyway. <laughs> this is, this, no, <laughs> this is, I'll tell you another funny story. I need to get working on this, but I got to tell you this. So today I texted uh, my dad. I texted my mom. If you don't know, my dad is hard of hearing. To the point that if if you don't if you're not talking to him face to face because he reads lips if he's not talking to him face to face he can't hear you so I texted mom which I could have texted dad but I said can I use dad's picture in my album and on my YouTube today because I always like to ask my family if I'm going to but I'm a preacher's kid so you know we used to get asked about when we were going to be in a sermon too so it was yeah. important so my dad sends me back a message and he says of course you can my fee 
is a thousand dollars, but since it's you, it'll only be nine hundred and ninety nine dollars. And I said, Man, "Look, that's a deal. I said I can't afford to pay you and Nick. I'm gonna need a freebie from you this week." And he said, "Okay, because it's you." So I got I got to use it for free. Anybody who knows Dad knows how he is. It's so funny. Uh, Donna, if you'll check the clearance section or the it's called the bargain buys. the bargain buys. That's where you'll find all the paper that we put in, and most of it is thirty five percent off. I think there's one pack in there that's even forty percent off. So. Uh, if you check you. that, you'll be able to find that in that section. Uh, otherwise, whatever paper that's in there is 25% off regular price, which is still a heck of a deal. So um, get what you want while you can. I'm siding. Okay. I think I know what I'm doing, but I'm siding. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to tell y'all, these come in so handy is use my little perfect rulers. <clears throat> What are these called? Per layer guides. They're not perfect. They're we are. They are perfect, but they're not perfect anymore. <laughs> they're not called perfect anymore. Oh, whatever. So the layer guides, I'm going to use those. They're really cute. I mean, they're really good. They're good for me to use on this. And I'm going to mat this in black and then also in football grain. So first I'm going to glue it down. Just like so. Hey, if y'all don't know, I know I'm talking about a lot of sales today. We have a lot going on here at the shop. We have been running since we got here getting stuff ready but after this immediately following this show at one o'clock on our facebook page may may made it we'll be having a stopper topper sale so many times you guys want to pick your specific stopper topper and i haven't told you this either hmm. they're the lowest price we've ever sold them <laughs> you can't handle it today it's been a rough day for old Vian. And um, we'll have these available in our Craftique sale. It's super fun. Y'all need to come over there. Even if you don't want a stopper topper, come watch it because we're also going to be doing some more Craftiques with crafty stuff because you guys really seem to like that. So come see how it works. I won't say the price right now. That's probably a good idea. It's probably best for you if I don't say it's it. It's probably best for you. <laughs> well, let me say this. You weren't here yesterday when we were doing math. And so I liked the math I came up with. And then you always do. Amber said, and we that's, always go broke. <laughs> that's the, it's like the Lucy and Ethel thing. You left me and Amanda here. God that's what you did. Um, and Amber said, Help us, Lord, Amber help said, us. Amber said, That's a lower price than we've ever offered it at. And I said, Well, he ain't here. <laughs> <laughs> That'll teach you to take an afternoon off, won't it? No. Look, that's cool. So now I got my 16 inch border, but what did I do right there? A little, little double cut. All right. And then I'm going to put it onto some football paper. I think I'm going to pop it up on this football paper. I wonder if I could cut this out. Let's just see if I can do this. I'm just going to cheat the system at a time so I don't have to measure. Why do I hate to measure this bad? Seriously. I would rather take a chance than measure. Anybody else like that? It's an eyeball thing. I would rather take a chance. It won't be perfect, but it'll be close if I can get it to turn without... Boom. Fix that. Okay. Anybody else like this? I know there's somebody out there that is. And I know there's somebody out there going, just measure it, woman. So, what y'all doing for the fourth? Anybody said already? Mm, everybody's shopping. <laughs> Thank <laughs> goodness. True. That's probably true. All right. So, I'm going to pop this up. Guess what we get to do today? Dun, Break dun, out dun. some Scotty. Dun, dun, dun. Look at this. Um, we're going to open some Scotty. I love the smell of a fresh Scotty. I'm just the weirdest. I know. Yes. Oh, it's know. so good. You have to smell it. It, it, it won't smell like this it's always. It's fine. You just it will get, it will get, rock your it'll own It will get less. <laughs> You'll miss it. You don't want to miss this. No one wants to miss It's good, isn't it? Be honest. It's good, isn't oh, it? Oh, wow. Yeah. What's it smell like? Chemicals. Nothing. It smells like chemicals. It does smell like something. No. It smells like adhesive. Babe, it smells like adhesive and you know it. Let me find my end. There it is. Had to feel it. Okay, so let's get some Scotty off of y'all. Foam us up, Scotty. All right, so what are people doing? Are they telling us now? Uh, one person said they were cooking with neighbors. One person said they are staying in the air conditioning. With their hubby. That's what I would be doing. One person said they were going to a baseball game to watch fireworks afterwards. Anybody cooking out? One person said they were, right? 
I'm sure a lot of people are cooking out, or at least a lot of their husbands are cooking out. You know what's interesting about that? I Write the date in there so you know when you first started using this roll of Scotty. Oh, I'm glad y'all said that. Do um, you know what's interesting? I fully know how to grill, but if I'm going to cook, I don't think grill. I think that's a man thing. Is it? I always think grill when I'm going to cook Never. most of the time. If I want a burger, I don't think grill. Ever. I always have to try to figure out how to adapt what I would do grilling to the oven. And I think oven first. Anybody else like that? All right, we got to write the date in here. Going to try to write it on the inside. What is oh? What is today's date? Today's July 4th. 7, 4, 19. Hey, we got a super chat from Laura. Happy Thank 4th you, of Laura. July. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you so much. <gasps> Appreciate that. And then this is going to go right here. Oh, look at that. I'm going to be able to use that background, huh? I think that works great, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. All right, so let's glue this guy down. Barb, it, this time it is only the stopper toppers. We don't have as much time today, um, so we're gonna we have a lot to go through. We have a lot of stopper toppers, and so it's just gonna be stopper toppers. But I am gonna be giving some things away, and the the grand prize today, like at the end of the show, we give away. You do have to be present to win, by the way. But the big prize today, he doesn't know this either. <laughs> The big prize today is a four ounce art glitter glue, a fine metal tip, um, a replacement cap in case you need it. It comes with a cap anyway, but we're just going to try to give you everything that we offer for that. So that's the big prize today. But we also will be doing two or three door prizes throughout the thing. And there is a share prize at the like at the end. We'll tell you how that works, but you can share it and um, there's a prize for that too. Look at that. All right. I took this little guy out because I thought it'd be cute to use some of these little images. So what? Do, these are cute could use those on the corners or around the bottom. Oh, I can make it like a little pennant, like a little banner. Let's see what this looks like. These are the wrong scissors for this job. Let's use the right ones. These are the right scissors. Snip. Okay, we did have, a well, two questions about Scotty. Um, one was, why do you use Scotty instead of foam tape? Do you have a, a reason for that? This is foam tape. Maybe they... Do they know? Is that what they're asking? I think they really want to know which one do you prefer, Scotty or Brutus Monroe. Oh, Brutus. The thing about the Brutus... Let me show you the difference. Oh, where is it? Here it is. I like Brutus for different things. I kind of like my Brutus Monroe tape for more like DIY projects. Because it's... Now, he has a new one, I think. And I haven't gotten that one. But this one is thicker. See that? So if I'm only wanting a thin lift, you can see the difference. Oh, gosh. You can see the difference here and how thick they are. That's the biggest thing It's just the thickness, especially when I only want a single thickness. If you want a double thickness, or uh, this is great. If you want it to have a, a good lift off the edge. I don't dislike that product. It's different. It's stickier. If you need a really sticky product, his product is much stickier. So, And I just lean to Scotty. It's just been my favorite. And sometimes I get into a rut. Do you guys do that where you just lean to that same product even when there's something else out there that might be better? I do. What if I just do these little guys down here like this? Like Now, Oka, the people in that photo, the guy on the right, I'm sure you recognize, is Coach Nick Saban. The man on the left is Eddie Gillenwater, <laughs> uh, May May's stepdad. That's kind of cute to add on there, just some little football -y dealies. I don't want to cover up June. I like June showing in there. Let's do it like that. So let's do this corner. I didn't put my pen back in my glue. So again, the difference mainly between the craft foam from Brutus Monroe and the Scotty foam tape is the thickness. Thickness. Well, it's a different, it's more foam. It's foamier. Is that a fair statement? Because it's thicker, it's foamier. It's a it's lighter weight too. If you're if you struggle with something being too heavy, the Brutus Monroe is a lighter weight foam. that not feel like it's going in the right direction but it is the opposite of that one let's do this one. Oh, i covered the j let's try not to cute just to add a little football-y stuff in there and then let me see um is there a word i want to use that little touchdown word is cute let's make a tab out of that one 
So let's do this. Let's cut this like so. Then let's cut this like so. Just going to get that out of there. Then I'm going to cut this down. I have not fussy cut it with my scissors. With my scissors. I haven't fussy cut it with my glasses yet. With my bifocals, trifocals, whatever they are. They're actually trifocals. And I have to lean back a little bit. Do y'all have to do that? Maybe I need to go get them adjusted again. Let's see. Benny, you are quiet today. I'm just reading comments. You want to share any with me? Well, I've been trying to along the way. Let's see. Do I want to put this down here? That'd be kind of cute sticking out under there. Oh, that's cute. Yep, that's where it's going. All right, so I'm going to There's a lot there. of folks cooking out. Good. A lot of folks cooking out. That's fun. I wish they'd run a plate by here. <laughs> I'm going to get up under there and squish that down. Make it where you can see it. That's cute. I like it. You like it? It turned out good. Yet again. I'm telling y'all, I think this might be my favorite craft. And I'll tell you something else. If you're making Christmas gifts for folks, this is a good one to make. Because even Sam said this to me. My daughter-in-law said, which I thought, she said, I think I'm going to make one of those. Because I like the highlighting one thing. And like with the baby, she pretty much, there's milestones that you can kind of highlight every month. Like last month would have been walking, you know, this month be yep. something else. It's really cute for that. And at the end of the year, we're oh, going to have wow. a full calendar. Jean's husband. I'm going to say Jean. It may be Jeannie. Uh, either way, her husband is cooking antelope on the grill. Oh, my goodness. How exciting would that be? I don't think I've mm. ever even thought about eating antelope ever. All right, check this out. So the way this works, I didn't show you this. Here's the magnet closure that helps it stand up. But at the end of the year, I will close this guy. Oh, I got it really full. There we go. All right, I will close this guy, and this little magnet will hold it shut, and it'll be a book. See? Isn't that cute? And then I've saved the cover. I did green because I feel like green's a good neutral. I'll save the cover to decorate. But I'm going to decorate mine like this, and it'll be a mini album I can save on my bookshelf or whatever and go through and look at this, the highlights of 2019. I think it's really cool. Uh, it is Jeannie. Oh, it is Jeannie. Yeah. I was saying Jean. I was saying it wrong. All right, so let's get back to our month. So we've got January done. We got all the way through. All the way through June is done. So now we have July. So see, now I can get my calendar. I do keep my calendar closed so I can keep up with what days I have that I'm doing things. And then when it's over, I'll have a mini album of spotlights. I guess it would help if I actually magneted it because I didn't. Isn't it cute? I love this idea. If you want to make one, I have a tutorial start to finish of how to do this. Um, I will get Jordan to come back and link it afterwards in the description. So, and that crazy last name, Portuguese, is Quelo. Oh, seriously, I would have never said Quelo. I would have never got Quelo out of that last never. name. Never. That's cool. I don't know what I would have tried to say, but it would not have been Quelo. <laughs> New Scotty. It still smells so good. <sighs> it still smells amazing. All right, guys, that's going to be it. I have to go get ready for um, the sale, but I cannot believe that I did that in 25 minutes. I was not expecting that. So, has anyone made one of these before? Read that last thing that before? Amanda posted just then so you can encourage them. Um, she posted, anyone interested in joining the Craftique sale? If you have not already, you will need to set up a postable account for your shipping info. Um, won't take but a second. It really doesn't. And she put the link for you guys. So if you're going to come shop with us at Craftique, be sure to put your post in there. And listen, you don't have to buy anything to win the prizes. So if you don't have anything to do and you just want to be in the room while we're doing it and you just want to be in on the prizes, you don't have to buy anything for that. We It's a it's a cool way we do it and you can win a prize. It'll be super fun. Okay. Just so you'll know, you don't want to miss Vinny's Vittel Saturday. It's going to be awesome. It is a five-ingredient peach cobbler with a surprise appearance from a six ingredient <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> that's funny um we're not doing a crafter after show today because we kind of did one tuesday on not really on accident but it kind of just happened because we were off on monday because of the gas leak by the way which is fine now but we came in on tuesday and did a live show that was kind of all the stuff we would have done in the crafter after show drawing people's winnings and things like that so we thought we'll do the other craftique since we have that af this afternoon to do it so, uh, Fatima said her dad wants her to make one of these. I think you should. It's a great gift for folks. It's the gift that works all year long. And you know what's even better? If you make it for somebody, and you can just take the page with you and do it for them. Do their highlight for them if you're the crafter and they're not. There will not be so. any biscuits in this week's video. Did you say that <laughs> word? 
What word? That word right there. I get in trouble if I give um, sneak peeks. Cobbler. You said, said that? It. Okay. He said it. You need to be there. It's really good. So Cheryl's made one, but she hasn't put pictures in it yet. It's time to put pictures in it, Cheryl. Uh, Mary, I didn't. Let me tell you what happened. The fireworks video last night. It was great. And then all of a sudden, the screen went black. But not for me, just for everybody else. And I kept going, it's showing, it's showing, it's showing. So Amber opened her phone behind me and said, no, it's not. And I went, oh, no. Then I thought, well, once it processes, it'll probably show because I could still see it. You know, I thought it was just messed up. So when I got home last night, I waited about an hour and a half because sometimes the HD videos take a long time to process. So I waited like an hour and a half and went and looked. And the whole ending was just a black screen. So I felt bad because here's the thing. We kept going. Oh, the finale's going to be great. The finale's going to be great. And we got none of the finale. So I thought, if you weren't there, I'm going to take it down so it doesn't. Because I hate for somebody to watch the whole video waiting on the finale and me knowing that it's not there. Yeah. And they, I think it would be hurtful to do that. So I just took the video down. It doesn't mean I can't go back and look, but I didn't have time to go look. Our fireworks show last night, apparently we had two different fireworks, one that would do a heart and one that would do a smiley face. And we kept looking away from it. And Josh was so funny. Did you hear what he said? Yeah. He was sitting next to me and he went, that's it. I'm not blinking anymore for the rest of the show. Yeah. <laughs> So funny. Um, Carol, you do not have to be a club member to get the sale prices, but they're not showing. When you do it, you have to put in the coupon code at the end. Boom, boom, 25. We're like normal stores now. We don't have all that. We used to have all this funny stuff to give club members or discounts. Now we don't. We have a club member coupon code and we have a, a sale code. The thing is, anytime, and it, this is even before, anytime our sale coupon or our sale is bigger than club discount, it was never stackable. So the club member discount won't work today because that only gets you 15% off. You want to use Boom Boom 25 to get 25%. Now, if you want to help me and save me some money, use your club discount and leave the other one alone. Thanks, Mary. I'm glad you enjoyed <laughs> it. But I really did. There was no way for me to say, hey, guys, the ending of this is rough because <laughs> it was already up, you know? Yep. I couldn't edit it. And I thought, I just would feel so bad if somebody watched it waiting on the finale and then it was a black screen and I didn't warn anybody. So I was like, Either it's either download it, edit it, put it back up, or just take it down. I just went with take it down. So, uh, but it was a good fireworks show. What does that mean? I'm confused. So you only sign up at the postal thing. I'm confused. The Facebook page for Craftique is May May made it. May May made it. Um, that is the Facebook page. I'm gonna let Connie... I think Amanda posted the link several times in the chat, so you can probably see it there. Oh, Connie, the sale will be on Facebook. And some people are asking me why we're doing it on Facebook. Until we're comfortable with what we're doing, until we have our process nailed down, I'm a little afraid to do it on YouTube because YouTube opens us up to a lot more viewers at a time than Facebook does. And until we have it nailed down, I'm a little afraid to do it on YouTube because I don't really know how quickly... Because see, what happens is when you put the title in sale... People flood to that, and I would be afraid we could end up with lots more people than we could handle. So right now, we're doing Facebook. The cool thing is this. You don't have to have friends. You don't have to follow people. You just need a Facebook account, and you just need to go to our page. That's it. You don't have to have, like, you don't have to be a member of groups or have posts on your account or anything. So um, that's why right now we're doing it that way. I, I'm talking to my YouTube partner manager about it to see if they have some kind of best practices or whatever, but I'm just afraid because I, I know good and well if we put, like, 4th of July sale in the title of a video, we could end up with a lot of viewers, which would be great. But right now, we don't have our process down well enough to handle it. And I think it would be chaos. But I think today we have a much better process. Pam, if, if you're having an issue with the second coupon, if you will call the store, um, they will give you a refund for that coupon uh, for your order. So our app developers are working on it. And he can get it to work on his end, but we can't get it to work on our end. And he... They, Amanda and him, I just want y'all to know how this works. I don't mind telling y'all. Amanda sends him screenshot of videos of her trying. He sends videos back of it working. But then yesterday she said, okay, use these codes that I've got and film for me what you're doing and see if I'm doing something wrong. And I don't know if she's gotten the video response back from him yet. So they are working back and forth. She is diligently trying to get that working. Um, so. Okay. Did I just say something wrong? Cause Amanda said you can only use one code during the sale. If it's a loyalty point you can call us if it's a it that it should be loyalty points loyalty points you can we'll do it but we'll have to do it in store we won't be able to do it on the website yet hopefully soon they're working on it poor amanda she's yesterday she brought me the video she said okay look we've gotten this far 
And she's like, but we're still trying, so. And then Monday starts Christmas in July, right? No, Saturday. Saturday? I'm so excited. Now, is the product for Christmas in July going to be available Saturday? Um, or is that Monday? I thought it was Monday. You know, I, it doesn't matter. It's supposed to be Saturday. Okay. I didn't think about that. Christmas okay. products are supposed to be in the store Saturday. Okay. I can help Take with that. I didn't think about that. I really want to show y'all this card. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited about this card. What card? The one for Saturday. Oh, Lord. I can't. Can I? Can I? I well, it's up to you. I mean, you're going to give away your Saturday video, video if you show it. Oh, it's, you're going to. Let me just say this. I'm super excited. Vince bought some some dyes for Christmas that I didn't know he was buying. And when I saw them, as soon as I saw them, I had been, I had been, my mom would be so mad at me. I was at Walmart <laughs> over Father's Day and they had a display when you walked in the door with these cards. They were really different the way they were done. And I'm like, we can totally do this. And so I took some pictures like to remind me of the build of the way they built the card. Mm -hmm. And when I came back, I started playing. And when I saw that, I'm like, this is going to work. <laughs> Mine did not. Mine are not like the Walmart ones. I just was inspired by them. I, they were much better because they were done on machine. You know what I'm saying? But this one is really good. I think you're going to like it. I think you will. So Saturday, Christmas in July starts. It's Christmas from here on out for July. All right. And um, I don't remember how many of those I ordered to start with, but I've already ordered more. Listen. Because when you showed it to me, I was like, dang, I didn't order enough. <laughs> I said, look what I did with that die set. And he went. Mm. He didn't even say anything. He went, mm. and he went on the computer and I said, what do you need? He said, order more. <laughs> so it's funny. So th he had, but you ordered more than you normally do. Yeah. So, all right. Yeah. Paula club member is not working this for this sale because your boom, boom 25 is a larger discount. You don't want to use your club member code because you can't stack them. So you don't want to use the 15% off. Use the 25% off. You get a better deal that way. All right. Y'all probably want the sale. Oh, they what, said show saying. it to them. They're going to watch anyway. All right. It's not the finished card. So that's fair. It's not the finished card because the finished card Jordan has. All I have is my um, prototype. You're going to need to put something white down. You think? Yes. Oh, the water medium app. This comes in cool because it doesn't reflect when I need something white. Look at that. I can't believe I'm giving this away, but that's okay. You had to be here to see it. So you get a perk, right? Yeah. So this is what it looks like flat. Okay. But when you put it and it's, and it fits in a five by seven envelope. All right. And when you open it, what happens is see how it goes into dimension. See the dimensions. And I, I tell y'all this in the video, but let me find my tea light. Where is she at? What did I do with it? Well, I'll use this one. This is not the one I encourage you to use. I encourage you to go pick up some LED ones. Not these kind. They're not strong enough because this is a big hole in here. But you take your tea light and you don't open the square like this. You open it long ways like this just for the tea light to sit in. And then it lights through. There's no way for me to show y'all that. So you open it like a diamond shape, not like a You're square. You're not going to see it in here anyway because there's not. not enough light. Well, I've if got you it. cut all the lights off, you might could tell. It's flooded with light in here. I have this flooded with light. And see, I also don't like how the flame comes out right there. But the way you're looking at it this way, it looks like that. But there's these little LED ones. Where did I put that little guy? Do you see it anywhere? It's just I do a little not. LED light. Well, I can't find it. But they, they have little LED ones that are really short bulbs. And that's what you want. First off, they're brighter. And they... um. That die is not available in the store today, no. No, we kept Christmas. Remember I told y'all, 4th of July and Christmas in July had to be separate. We weren't going to put them together. But this is going to be your favorite thing. And easy, y'all wait. You're going to be shocked how easy this is. Now, it'll fit in your 5 by 7 flat. This is how I would do it, flat like this. And I'd put it in my envelope so when the person pulls it out, they pull it out like this. But you can also shut it down. Shut it down. And it'll fit like this, but I wouldn't send it like that. I think that looks bad. It is actually it. Like two dies. It is. They're coordinating dies. That coordinate with one another. <gasps> Duh. I'm not showing that one. They got to wait on that one. I'm not showing the finished card. Cut that light off, Jordan. Let's see if, if you can really see it. Okay. See way. this little LED dude right here? This is a little different. This is an LED light. And when you turn it on, like you twist it to turn it on. And then let me see if I can just stick it under here. I'm just going to do it sideways. This little, look at that. 
See the difference with that beautiful, bright LED in there? Y'all, gosh, I love this. So you'll see this video on Saturday. I love this card. Thanks, Jordan. He's my light man too now. All right, so that's the beginning, and you'll see what I did to dress it up because I dress it up a little bit uh, Saturday. My, matter of fact, my heat embossing people, come to that one because there's heat embossing in it. All right, guys. Love you very much. I got to head out. Jordan's got to have my phone so we can do um, get ready for the Facebook sale. Y'all come over there and just hang out. It's a fun time, isn't it? It is fun. Even if you don't want to buy anything, it's just fun to see how this works. I think you'll enjoy it. Come hang out with us, and um, we will see you guys in a few minutes. I got to find my mouse. There it is. Bye, guys. Oh, Yvette. Oh, I, I won't be bye. selling. I'm sorry. I won't be selling the lights because the lights, I don't know where to find them for to wholesale. But I tell you what, I will try to find an Amazon link. I might can find an Amazon link, but I would look at Walmart or the Dollar Tree. I'll try to find them and put a link to them for you, but look for something bright like the LED situation. All right, that's the water media mat? Yeah, this is the water media. There's some videos on my channel recently about this. All right, guys. It helps if I need white because it doesn't reflect. The other, see, look, this side is reflective. See the shine? But this side is not, so it helps when I need a white background. All right, guys. Love y'all. We're going to see y'all at the Craftique Show at 1 o'clock. If you're coming, come hang out. Come win some prizes. It'll be super fun. All right. Talk to y'all guys in a little bit. Bye. Bye.